I received an email today and it totally shook my world. Uh, let's get started here with the email, okay? So I'm gonna make myself small here. So here you go. Uh, I got this email today. I've locked out my client's email. Websites made with Google Business Profiles will be turned off soon. So a little bit of context. If you've never used a Google Business Profile, you might not really know what this is. Um, so the way this works is you fill out your Google Business Profile. By the way, we have a masterclass coming soon here on the channel, so you're gonna wanna subscribe. But anyway, you fill out your Google Business Profile all the way, and then you could just click one button and you would like immediately get this little website and it would end with dot business dot site pretty handy a lot of businesses use it in the area here's the problem google's turning those off in a couple months um actually it says march 1st so that's like what is that two months that's less than two months from now that's such a quick turnaround uh, and so uh, one of my clients has uh this site they have since updated that so they have their own site now um, but I just saw this and I said holy crap this is a really big deal like why um, are people not covering this I've been searching for it all day uh, ever since I saw the email and I'm just not really getting anything so I just wanted to kind of dig into this a little bit more um, so if you go to Google um, it does cover it here um, so basically just says uh, you know websites made with Google business profile will be turned off soon here's the facts here's what we know uh, March 1st the websites made with Google Business Profiles will be turned off. See that? Turned off and customers visiting your site will be redirected to your Google Business Profile. Um, and that redirect will work until June 10th. At that point, it'll be redirected to nothing. Um, and then further down, it says, um, let's see, when your website is turned off. So once this website made is turned off in March, customers attempting that will be redirected to your business profile. Um, and starting on June 10th, they'll get the, the link will not work at all. And so, you know, my theory is that this has to do with Google getting rid of their domain service and Squarespace being like, we don't want to do the business. It's dot business dot site. Now you may be thinking like, okay, who does this really affect? Is there a lot of people? So great question. Um, so let's just do a quick search here. We're going to go site. Um, we're going to go dot business dot site and I'm gonna do Bend Oregon because that's where I'm located uh, and what this is gonna show now in the search results is every single site that has a dot business dot site um, website out there um, and a lot of these are smaller businesses right um, that may not be too affected by this well actually no that's not true they're gonna be super affected by this think about this if you're a small business you might not have the money to all of a sudden within two months go find a web designer hey like me uh, to do this for you so what are you what are you going to do you're gonna have to like quickly hop on something like Squarespace and build out a half-ass site and um, I don't know I mean I just feel like this isn't very googly of Google like they got rid of Google domains this year they're getting rid of uh, not Google sites that's different that's a page builder and so that was actually a question that I had uh, somebody brought that up in the web design community that I'm in they said oh, wait Google sites is actually recommended at the bottom of that email so let me uh, show you right here um, it says you know you can use a web page builder like Wix Squarespace GoDaddy Google Sites, Shopify WordPress wait Google Sites isn't that what they're saying is gonna go down well I had to even go to chat GPT and I said you know explain to me the difference between the the business dot site and the Google site and it, it's basically saying that you know a Google site is different that's like Google's page builder um, that's free um, so that's something that's an option. I don't know if they're gonna have like an export to Google Sites feature. That would be nice um, They're both free um, But it looks like this is going away, you know, so It's a real drag um, So again, just kind of go back, you know, all of these businesses that probably can't afford it uh, Now have to come up with a new option for their website overnight So it's a great business opportunity if you're a web designer uh, and terrible if you're a small business owner. So, you know, if you're a small business owner out there, um, you know, the first thing I would do is, um, you know, check your page. So we, right here, with just, just a random one, promotion, physical therapy. Uh, I'm gonna open them in a new tab. So this was their old um, dot business dot site right here. And so if I look for their, um, their Google business profile, which is right here, um, the website that it links to is in fact, 
this site. And so what they're saying, to use them as an example, is this site is not going to work after March 1st. And in fact, on June 10th, this will not go to anything ever again. Uh, this will redirect to nothing. So, um, you know, I have to imagine that a physical therapy clinic is a pretty big business. They might be able to survive this. They might reach out, find a web designer to work with, um, and be able to do that. But, you know, if you look at some of these other examples here, you know, we're talking about, uh, you know, like an art studio, uh, fingerboards, maybe that could be a big one, you know. Uh, a lot of, I was seeing some food carts in here earlier. Um, you know, small places like a, like a cake, a cake service, you know, these were perfect for these Google sites and now the service is gone. So anyway, I just want to make sure that this is out there in the open because there's just not a lot of content regarding it. It looks like they sent out the email today. So this might be brand new. Uh, again, you can go to Google and kind of read over this post, but that's the nuts and bolts of it is that if you have a dot business dot site web address, it is not going to work after March 1st of 2024. Today's January 8th, so that's like four weeks. So you got, or not, that's not four weeks, it's eight weeks. You have eight weeks to figure it out, people. So uh, good luck. If you need help figuring it out, hey, check it out. Ben Can Designs, Ben Web Designs. So, uh, you know, we, we build websites out here. But uh, real pitch here, if you actually want to figure out how to build your own landing page, because I realize that a lot of people are not going to be able to afford this uh, on this Thursday, today's Monday, this Thursday, I'm actually going to do a live stream. Again, this was kind of a test, uh, just happened to be convenient that there was news to cover. Um, but uh, there, I'm going to do a live stream on Thursday night where I build a landing page using WordPress. So WordPress is free. Um, a lot of the tools around WordPress aren't free to make it better, uh, but it's definitely a good starting place if you're just trying to DIY. Um, and the principles that I'm going to go over will translate to other things like Squarespace or even Google Sites if that's what you end up going with. So I just wanted to throw that out there. Google business profile websites are going down March 1st, 2024. Make sure you prepare if you're a small business out there. If you're a web designer, you might want to find those small businesses they're trying to prepare and hopefully we can link up and it could be a win-win because it helps when small businesses can help other small businesses out, especially in smaller communities. So. Uh, that's my uh, SEO tip for the day. If you're looking for more SEO tips, be sure to head to yoursmallbizseosuccess.com, link in the description, and sign up for my email list where I'll be sure to post more news. Uh, usually it's not breaking like this, but definitely look forward to uh, seeing you there. It's super easy. It takes like a minute to sign up, and you get some, some freebies there. So anyway, I think we're going to cut it there because that's all we need to cover. Um, Till next time.